Hello, good morning. We are currently in my car. All of my windows are frozen. I need to turn my car on and defrost. But today is going to be more of like a vlog style video for Vlogmas. Um, I don't know which day of Vlogmas this is going to go up, but this is definitely one of the videos. Today I am going to be shopping for some Christmas decor. So I'm a Grinch, like everyone knows that about me. I am not a super Christmassy person, but my husband lives and dies for Christmas, like Christmas is his thing. So I'm gonna do a little bit of Christmas shopping. We already have quite a bit of Christmas stuff. I have like um, in storage in our garage, like two huge uh, like Rubbermaid tubs, you know what I'm talking about? Filled with Christmas decorations, but it's always fun to look and kind of get some new stuff and change up like your style every year. Normally we are kind of like all over the place and I think this year we're wanting to go a little bit more like elegant, a little bit more classy Christmas. Um, so that's what I'm doing today. I'm shopping for some Christmas stuff. I think I'm going to go to Target and Marshalls, possibly Home Goods. It just depends on like what I find at Target and Marshalls. I don't want to buy like a bunch of stuff, but I do want to get like a few things, you know, um, some lights, some candles. Uh, that's about it for the vlog though just mainly shopping for christmas decor oh look at this cup i got this is so cute this is like one of those um starbucks you know like reusable plastic cups but it's a christmas one it says coffee all the way it's so cute spencer bought me like a whole pack of them so there's like four different ones and they're all like seasonal they're red and green and they're really fun uh but first things first i have to go to the freaking bank because we went to bend a couple weeks ago and I left my debit card there so I had to cancel my debit card and I haven't had any of my cards so I gotta go to the bank and get a new debit card which kind of sucks but whatever then we'll be off and we'll be shopping okay guys we made it to Target it is so freaking sunny outside but it's literally like 35 degrees so let's do it let's get some shopping on oh my god do you see this person next to me awkward these ones but I don't like like see how the stuff is just falling off of it so I think I'm gonna get these plain ones okay guys leaving Target now just loading up my trunk I actually got way more stuff than I was expecting. I don't want to say I went like overboard, but I definitely got more than I was expecting. So I think that I'll probably just go to Marshall's. I won't go to Home Goods. Maybe I'll do that another time. Um, but yeah, just packing up the trunk. And then let's head over to Marshall's. 
Always put your cart back. Okay, so I just left Marshall's and I, I don't want to say it was a bust because I did get a couple cute things But it was a bust in the sense that I like was not able to film at all. They were so Busy like I was not they opened 30 minutes ago, and I did not expect it to be this freaking busy like they probably had on staff I would say at least 20 employees I felt like there was employees everywhere like unloading stuff and they constantly were like asking me questions and like the employees were being nice like they were doing their job but there was like a lot of them plus there was like just a lot of people shopping already so I didn't feel very comfortable filming it was just I got like a little bit of footage but really not that much at all because there was just so many people there I felt so uncomfortable filming them and there were so many employees so what I think I'm gonna do because I did get quite a bit of stuff today so I'm gonna go home and then I'll like show you guys everything I got I'll do like a haul of that all right we're back in the back cave so I just got home obviously and I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Target and from Marshall's but first I wanted to show you these Starbucks cups that I was talking about so this one has like condensation all over it but this is like the one that I'm using today. It's all green and it says coffee all the way and it has this cute like candy cane straw. So it came in this pack from Starbucks. We actually got this at the Starbucks inside of our grocery store. Like you know how they have like, merch is not the word but I think it is the word cause it's merchandise. Yeah, yeah, anyways. Um, Spencer bought me this so you guys know that I like just like the plain Starbucks reusable cup but these are like the holiday ones and it comes in this pack you get five cups which that's a lot of cups like at max at max I would need two but I love them and I'll probably like give some to my friends or whatever because I don't need all five um, but if you were wanting to buy this like for you and your friends I think it's it's $16 so if you and your friends went in for it you can you know you got all these cups Anyways, let me show you to them because they're super cute. So the one I already showed you and then there's this red one. This says Magic Cool. This other green one, it says, what does it say? Seasonal Shine. This red one, which I think is like so cute, says Merry Coffee. And then this one, I was making jokes about. It's like a peach color, but to me it looks like like when you put like spaghetti sauce or something in your Tupperware and then it like turns colored. This one says cold as ice. And then they all come with like the corresponding lid as well as well as they all come with the corresponding color in the candy cane reusable straw. I used the red one with my cup today instead of the green one because I just thought it looked cute. But I really love these cups and I think they're like a really great like gift because you have five of them. So if you had like your friends you were wanting to buy these for or an office or something these are super cute for the holidays so I'm gonna go through Target first so the first things I got were these pillows they're so cute I got just got two of this same one for my couch so they're just like a nice taupey tan color and then they have the white uh, trees on here and yarn the back is completely plain but you can kind of see there's like a little bit of gold shimmer in that yarn really cute for christmas like we don't really like going like really cartoony or really santa -y or like really red like we like uh the greens and white and gold and silver and stuff like that and this year i think that we're really gonna go for like a natural tone kind of christmas theme uh we'll still have some cute fun stuff out but i think we're going for more like a natural tone and i thought these pillows not only fit that perfectly, but they match the rest of my house and my couch good. Like there was like a lot of pillows that I thought were like cute and Christmassy, but they didn't match my couch at all. 
and they didn't match like the rest of my house i didn't want it to like clash super hard i wanted it to kind of like you know blend in so i got these ones i think these are gonna look so cute on my couch and they're actually like a like a good pillow like sometimes when you buy like the holiday ones they're like super thin it's like nothing is in there except for air these are like a good pillow um next i got this which isn't really like a christmas decoration they're just baking sheets they got a cute gingerbread man on them but uh i'm gonna do a lot of christmas baking i think i'm gonna do a video where i do um doing just like christmas treats because i love homemade cookies and i love baking and stuff so i'm gonna do some christmas bakes this year and i didn't have enough pans so i just got these oh this next thing i got i had to get it immediately when i saw it it is so cute so what it is is it's like this big piece of wood and it has this gold merry christmas on it it's super heavy and it has up close here you can see these are for hanging your stockings so normally i just like tack my stockings up um because i don't have anything to hang them with and then they get so heavy and then i end up having to put them on the floor and i thought this would be super cute because I don't know if you remember from my Halloween video, my like entertainment center, that's usually where we hang our stockings. So I'll put this like in front of the TV kind of, and it's super, it's pretty short. So I'll just put this in front of the TV and then I'll have like a nice thing to hang my stockings for. I thought this was so cute. It's expensive. I'm not gonna lie, this was $30, but it's super high quality. I can just feel how high quality it is. And I know that I will literally save this and use this every single year. Like it is so cute. All right, next I got some lights. I got four boxes of just the twinkling lights. I love the twinkling lights. They are so pretty. And I'm actually really good about saving our lights every year. So we have a few strands of lights put away, but we have like red and green lights. We have plain white lights. We kind of like to change up our lights every year um just you know to go for like the different theme and i got these ones this year i think we're gonna do like a really warm white twinkling kind of feel so i got four boxes of the twinkling because last year i actually wanted to do the twinkling lights and they were sold out everywhere by the time i went to get them they were literally sold out everywhere so this year my husband was like you better buy um quick like get the boxes and get more than you think you're gonna need because I don't want to hear you complain about them being sold out so i got them i got four boxes of them i got this uh garland what is this it's just tinsel garland it's gold there's 15 feet of it this is only four dollars it was so cheap but i've been seeing a lot of uh i've been on pinterest okay i've been christmas pinteresting and i saw like a lot of retro christmas trees they would wrap like the tinsel garland around it and i just thought that looked really cute so that's my plan for this hopefully it works out because otherwise i don't know what else i'm going to use this for but i want to put this on our tree i got two little boxes of like led uh <clears throat> lights and these ones are actually twinkling as well they call them a uh, dew drop lights but i got made sure to get the twinkling ones yeah i i'm like did i did i get the right ones so i got the twinkling ones because you can always use little fairy lights like and these are super cheap they're only six dollars a piece and they are, oh, I should have bought batteries. They're battery operated. That's what's cool. It says it has a timer on it. So just six hours on, 18 hours off. Dope. I mean, who doesn't need twinkling lights for Christmas? So I don't have a lot of like Christmas t-shirts or sweaters and stuff like that. I'm a Grinch. I've been saying it. You already know if you know me. And this year I am really trying to make Christmas like a big deal because my husband loves Christmas so much and I'm always so negative about it and such a Grinch that I was like, all right, this year, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to get into the Christmas spirit. So I'm making a mission to buy some Christmas sweaters and some Christmas clothes. Long story short, I saw this one and it was perfect for me. Do you see this? It's the Grinch. It's a super cute sweater. It's just, let me. <laughs> yeah, that's a better view. It is the Grinch. It's like a really cute knit sweater, plain on the back, but on this sleeve, see if i can get it to show it says naughty down the sleeve and then on this one it's just the red stripe but i was like this is the perfect sweater for me when spencer sees this he's gonna crack up because he's gonna be like wow yeah that's you <laughs> this next thing was a total impulse buy and i still like it i still think it's cute but i'm kind of like mm, 
I impulsed on that for sure. Um, this is just a little plate. It says, what does it say? Oh, Christmas treats. Oh, Christmas treats. And I just got it because I thought it'd be cute after I made my cookies if I put them on this plate for the video and just for real life. But normally I wouldn't leave a plate of cookies out because I would eat them all. I got a sifter, a flour sifter. I low key think sifters are a scam by like the food industry, but I'm trying to go hard. I told you, I'm trying to go hard on the Christmas this year. So I'm gonna sift my flour and shit for my cookies and hopefully it ends up good. I got two candles. I got another one of this coconut berry candle. You already know, this one is so good. I love having this one in the house. It's so fresh, it's so coconutty, but not in like a warm way, just like a nice clean way. And then I did smell, it's like fuzz. I did smell uh, quite a few of their holiday candles they have out and I swear they all smell gross. Like they all were like toffee nut butter, hazelnut, surprise, like ugh. So I got this one in holiday spruce. I mean, it's just a basic pine candle. It's really cute, but I thought Spencer would like this one on his desk because it's really small and he loves like pine smells, so. I got that for him. And then I got these guys. These I thought were super cute. They're just little fake um, trees in like the burlap on the bottom, but they're super heavy. Like this is definitely like a rock in here. It's really heavy, but I got two of them the same size. I don't know where I'll put them in my house. Maybe like on other the other side. Ooh. Maybe like this. cute yeah maybe i'll do it like this this is super cute like by my tv we usually have two christmas trees in our house we'll do like one big traditional christmas tree where we put like all of our fun ornaments on and stuff like that and then we have a small we have a dwarf christmas tree so it's like a really small one that we actually keep in a pot year round and just like trim it up and stuff that we decorate for christmas every year so me and Spencer have been together for five years and we started this thing during our first Christmas together where we would buy a Christmas ornament like together. We both picked it out each year and then we would put it on this small tree. And then so like when we've been together for like 30 years, we'll have 30 ornaments for this tree. So, so far we have four ornaments. This is, or maybe do we have five? I think this might be our sixth Christmas. No, I think we only have four. So we're getting our fifth ornament this year. So our little tree will have five ornaments on it. One for each year that we've been together. It's like this cute little thing we do. Like I said, Spencer loves Christmas. It was his idea. It is so cute and I actually really love doing it. So you'll see um, my little tree more um, in some later videos, like when we go get our big tree and stuff like that and decorating our trees. But it is just so cute. So basically, long story short, we usually have one big tree in our sliding in our we usually get one big tree and put it in front of our sliding glass door right here and then we have that little tree and we clear off the kitchen table and we put that little tree on the kitchen table because it is it is like really small it's probably only like two and a half feet three feet like it's it will like in its lifetime only get to like four feet tall like it'll stay really really small um, and then we have it just in like a nice planter, like a nice cement planter. So it looks good when we bring it in the house. Um, so we'll do that. So I don't like putting a lot of trees up in the house. Like, oh, and then we have, and then we also have a mini like pine. It's like a mini pine. Pl Let me grab it because I don't really know how to describe it. Be right back. Okay. So we also have this. It's like a house plant, um, and it's a, called a, a mini Norfolk Island pine. So this isn't going to get that much bigger. It's a house plant. So if anything, it'll get, you know, a little bit bigger. But it's in the pine tree family, and right now we have it already kind of decorated for Christmas with the bows and stuff on it. So that'll be three real trees in our house. And my house isn't that big, and I have a lot of house plants. I think I have like 25 house plants. Um... So it looks like a jungle in here during Christmas, and I thought those little fake trees would just be so cute to kind of tie it all together. But I don't think I'm gonna buy like really any more tree stuff after that because we got like, we live in a jungle. Okay, so that's everything I got from Target. 
I went pretty hard at Target. I really didn't think that I got that much stuff, but I guess I did. I mean, it's really not that much. It's just like everything's big. Uh, cool, I'm getting excited for once. I sent, um, I was texting Spencer today and telling him like, oh, I'm Christmas shopping, but like, you know, don't worry, I'm not doing it all. And then I was like, I'm actually starting to get into the Christmas spirit this year. So then I sent him, um, like a gif of the Grinch. I'll try to put it up here on screen. You know when the Grinch is like, help, I'm feeling. I sent that to him, it was hilarious. I know, I know. So, let's move on to Marshalls, the stuff I got from there. <laughs> I know I just went on that whole speech about how I'm not doing more trees. I get it, okay. This is the last one. This is the last one. I got this from Marshalls. It is so cute. It's like made of wood. So this is like, it was all one like log and then it was carved out of it. So it's really nice and it's really basic. I saw like everything I feel like that's covered in glitter and stuff like that just makes such a mess. Like when you touch it, it like explodes, like glitter gets everywhere or like the white fluff gets everywhere. And I'm just like not into that mess. Like I don't want to deal with that. And I just thought this was so cute. It's like almost like something you could keep in your house year round, I feel like, because it's like, it looks like Christmas, but it's also just a tree. Cute. The next thing I got were these hand towels for the kitchen. So if you saw my Halloween video, you saw that like on my oven and on my counter, I put those like uh, cute Halloween ones. And I thought it would be fun to do that again for Christmas. So these are like stuck together, what the hell? Oh. That's why. So I got two of the same pattern, but they're really cute. They are just like a checkered black, gray, and white. And then they have little gold Christmas trees all over them. So I just got two of those, so four towels. And they feel really nice. I wouldn't buy uh, towels that didn't feel like good enough quality for an actual kitchen towel. Because I'll just wash these and store these and then use them again next year. I got this, this was the first thing I picked up at Marshalls and it is so cute. It is um, a table runner. So, you know, it's like a tablecloth that is like only goes down the middle. Uh, and we have one that's like black and white, but we've used it for the past, I think like four years now. And I just saw this one, I thought it would be really cute. It is just squared out at the bottom. It's not pointy, it doesn't have anything hanging from it. And it just has these nice white Christmas trees all over it the same pattern all the way down and they have like gold beads let me see let me get one that's right side up what's going on here okay so it's just you could see the gold beads and then the white yarn and they're all different and the fabric is like canvas almost but with like gold thread sewn in it so it very like matches the pillows too actually um but i thought this would be so pretty and it's just like a nice neutral but still Christmas me, so it matches my house really well. And it's super cute. And then lastly, I got some coffee cups. So I got two different coffee mugs. I will say Marshall's had so many coffee mugs, like it was insane. Um, the first one I got is this one right here, it's so cute. I love Snoopy. I love Snoopy so much. I don't know why. I've always just had like a soft spot in my heart for Snoopy ever since I was a kid. I love watching the Charlie Brown cartoons. I love the comics. Like Snoopy just gets me. Like he gets me, you know? <laughs> it's so weird because I think I like like animated dogs because I also love Scooby-Doo. Like I go hard for Scooby-Doo and Snoopy. Interesting probably something to say about that anyways back to the cup so i got this it's so cute it's just snoopy and it says merry christmas all the way around and then it's just red on the inside but the reason why i got this cup i got this one for myself um is that it's huge i love a really big coffee mug because i drink tea i drink a lot of tea throughout the day and i just don't like a small mug like i like having a really big mug like i don't know how else to say but this one is huge and then i got this one for spencer i didn't want to like get way too many coffee cups because i already have a lot of coffee cups like i buy coffee cups it's just like my thing you know um i got this one for spencer super cute it's also snoopy and it's him in a santa costume 
he's not like as big as a Snoopy fan as I am, but he loves Christmas, so I know he's gonna love this cup. <laughs> and on the back it just says, uh, joy, peace, love. It's red on the inside. So just for like, so you could see the size difference in these cups. This is the one I got me and this is Spencer's. Like, yeah, this one's way bigger. And that's it. <laughs> that is all of the stuff I got. I guess I did haul a lot harder than I thought I was going to for sure. Um, yeah. Wow. I will mo most likely probably do one more shop. I really want to find a wreath wreath a wreath <laughs> um for my front kitchen window right there i think it'll be cute to like hang one right there we usually buy a live one i, I guess it's not live because you don't water it but we buy a real one from this plant nursery in town they hand make them there and they are so big they're so nice they smell really good they're really good quality um so i might record so I'll probably what I'll do is the next time I go out to do decor, we'll probably go to that nursery to get the wreath and I'll film all that and then take you guys along with me and show that. But um, thank you for joining me on this Vlogmas video and I'll see you in the next one, which might be decorating the house. <laughs> Bye.